Well, with another new multi-million dollar facility planned for Foundation Park in Sioux Falls, the area is really beginning to take shape. Last year, Amazon announced it's building a distribution center there. And yesterday, the city announced that CJ Foods USA is going to build a 700,000 square foot state-of-the-art facility. But the city says this is just the beginning of something they've been planning for years. Foundation Park is just that a foundation for the city of Sioux Falls to attract large companies to move here. Well, I think the state of South Dakota is pretty attractive in and of itself. I think we have a good tax structure that works really well for a lot of companies. Um, I think the, the quality of life that we have here, I think the culture that we have here, the work culture that we have here, uh, people like to work. Foundation Park has been five years in the making. Now with Amazon and CJ Foods committed to build on the 800 acre site, it's beginning to take off with a total of six tenants so far. CJ Foods is a world-class Asian food production facility. It adds up to a $500 million investment in the city. It's just a big deal. That'll be a historic record-breaking building permit for us in Sioux Falls, uh, as well as bring 600 uh, well-paying jobs, full-time jobs to our community uh, in the midst of a pandemic. But does the Sioux Falls area have enough workers to fill those jobs? That's the number one question we get asked when companies are looking at Sioux Falls. Is they love everything. They love the tax climate. They love the community. They even love the weather most of the time, but the workforce is always the challenge. Sioux Falls Development Foundation President and CEO Bob Munt thinks finding enough workers shouldn't be a problem because along with attracting new companies to move here, the city is also ramping up efforts to recruit workers. Companies typically, if they're paying uh, a good wage, if they're paying um, you know, what they need to be in order to get the workers, they're going to get that. It's going to be a game changer. And Bob Munt says that there are other companies in the pipeline that have shown interest in moving here but haven't committed yet. For more about the companies that are already part of Foundation Park, head to our website for this Coverland.com original story by Ray Yost.